Professor Forp here, and now I have an important math question for you. What kind of meals do mathematicians eat? Square meals! And if you are sane, I don't get it. It's because you haven't learned about area yet. But don't worry, you are about to. As I said before, I never repeat myself, so pay attention. Area is the number of square units in a given space. Knowing how to figure area is helpful when you are tiling the floor, putting shingles on your roof, installing carpet, or doing many other things. See this rectangle. It can be divided into 18 squares. Each square has four sides that are one meter long. Another way of saying it is one square meter, or one meter squared. It is written like this. Think of it as three rows with six squares in each. Or, in other words, as 6 times 3, which equals 18. Be sure to label the area by the type of unit that was used to measure it. Since the squares are meters, we would say that this rectangle is 18 meters squared, or 18 square meters. You would label the area like this. The 2 is read as squared, and means that you are measuring the number of squares. The easiest way to find the area of a rectangle is to multiply the length times the width. Oops, what are we here? Another rectangle. That's a lot of squares. Let's count how many. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wait a minute. We can just multiply length times width to get the area. 100 times 30 equals 3,000 meters squared. Ooh, that was easy. What about an irregular shape like this? Just break the shape into rectangles and add the area of each rectangle. This shape can be broken into three rectangles. Here's one, there's one, and here's another. The areas of each are figured separately and then added. Two times four equals eight meters squared. Three times one equals three meters squared. And three times five equals 15 meters squared. Now add them all up. 8 plus 3 plus 15 equals 26 meters squared. Remember our important question. What kind of meals do mathematicians eat? Square meals. Ah, oh, now you get it. I knew that you would. Speaking of food, why did the two four skip lunch? They already ate. So there you have it. Area. The number of square units in a given space. Until next time, be sure to learn new information daily. Be sure to share and subscribe for more videos that make learning fun.